Bombers will keep the puck in. Thornton will pick it up, back of the Melford net. Up the boards to Poprovsky. He lost a hand of Lees with the steal, got a shot away, got blocked. He'll get his own rebound, he can't shoot it. Justin Lees, some nifty stick handling, to the slot, a shot scores! Justin Lees! And put the Bombers on the board here with a beautiful snapshot. And for Justin Lees, that's his ninth of the season. Beautiful goal by Lees here, number nine. I can't think of too many per more prettier goals than that one, Rob. Justin is so good with the puck. The captain, Justin Lees, will take the face off here against Rue to the right of Harmon Laser Hill. And the Bombers win the draw. And Lees quickly away, short handed. He's got a break down the right side. Lees cutting it back at her. Oh, a good save by Ben. He'll throw that back to his defense partner, Noah Hool. Up the middle. Knocked down by Paul. He'll dump it in. Try to work in on Day. Day bumped off the puck. It comes out front. Paul's got it. Slides the goal left and he scores! Great work by Ashton Paul. They jump on the Belford D. And Kyle Owens going to collect that for his third of the year. Boy, it's not often to get two goals by uh, James Benn in half the period of hockey, but the Bombers have accomplished that so far tonight. Back here on opening weekend. There's a chance for more. He'll get a shot away. A stick save made that time by Laser Hume. A very good opening period for him. Semp can't knock it down. Day at the blue line on target. Oh, loose puck. The Mustangs get a freebie. Laser Hume had it, and he couldn't hang on. Puck got away from him. And Hamilton, give him credit, knows to go to the front of the net. Knocked down by Day, he'll flip it in, Bridger out of the box, and the Mustangs are 0 for 4 on the power play in this game. McNutt to center, he can fly. McNutt across the line, gets it, he scores! McNutt did Ben never saw it, he went down over top of his right shoulder. And again, that goes to prove the point that I told you. James Ben is not himself tonight. No, although, Rob, I... I he I didn't even move on that. No. Lost the handle, Duguay with the steal. Throws it out front, just behind Hamilton. Hamilton will pick it up. He's got the Melfort goal. Back to Olison. back out front. Here's a chance for Duguay. Duguay to the slot, shoots a good save again. Puck leg behind Laser Hume, and they jam it in. Who will keep the puck inside the Mustang zone. Flip on the power play for another 52 seconds. That's thrown in. Day intercepted it. Can't get it out, held in by Houle. Up front, there's a one-timer, a good shot by Anderson. Bucks squirts free. Oh, fired off the post there. Silvestri, within an inch of restoring the two-goal lead, he had an open net but was off balance, got a stick on it. Goalies these days are so good. McNutt back to Piccinino, side of the goal. Here's a chance for Paul, he can't get it to go. Vend is there, rebound, the Bombers try to jam it, they get it in. No, the goal waved off. He Leah went. Bridger thought he shoveled it in, so did I. But the referee waved it off immediately. No, who will knock it down on the boards? This is Jacob Bachler. Four power play goals to lead his squad this year to Lees. Back to Hull. Top of the circle. Here's Anderson, a back end off the wide open. That's the best streak in. That's the James Van I know. Belton gets it out. Laser Hill will race well out of his net. Just five shots on him in the second period. Here's a nice pass to Silvestri. Silvestri walks in, he scores! <laughs> Alexi Silvestri, forward of the month, and he lets that one rip. He's been denied twice tonight, once by the goal post, once by a gigantic save by Ben, but a goal scorer of that quality, you can't, uh, you can't give him opportunities to get it from Point Blank Bridge. That's Olison for the Mustangs, obviously. Hamilton took a good hit. Ryu, who's got a goal, comes back out front. That's grabbed here by Moore, who's had a nice game for the Mustangs tonight. Moore will keep it in. Slides it back to Olison. Olison out front. Duguay, the one-timer, he scores! Duguay on the power play. Seventh power play goal for him here this year. Cut for two on one the other way, three on one. Bachler leading the charge down the wing. Out front, pass to Mueller. Oh, Vin comes over and robs him. Semp will come back and grab the puck inside his own zone, up the right side. He's got Bachler again behind the D. Flipped it in. There's Silvestri looking for a second night. Silvestri, can he get it to go? No, he can't. He'll find Hamilton. Hamilton a goal tonight. Back across the barber line. Ryu will steal it. Back up front to Duguay looking for a second of the game. And Laser Hill will flash the leather and make a good stop on him. Moore threw it to the corner to, to Olison. Patterson. Oh, big hit there 
Bridger comes over, runs into his guy, Shepard, big collision here in the Mustang zone. This is Duguay, back to Hamilton, Hamilton at center. Inside the flint flan zone, back out front, Duguay, the back out, he scores! Second of the night, it's a tie hockey game, Mike Slip again. That big save by James Venn in the second period, I think it's gonna be a factor here tonight. Flint flan back the other way, here comes Jacob Vockler. Vocker stick handling the center across the Melfort line. Drop that one back to Sylvester. To Vocker. Back up front, the one timer. Lee's chance for Anderson. And he won't miss from there. The initial shot got blocked. Then the puck was laying there. And Anderson will pick it up. He'll shovel it in for the power play goal. That is the seventh of the season for Carter Anderson. Seven games in a bomber uniform, seven goals. Yeah. So a power play goal by Carter Anderson. The difference, the Bombers find a way to uh, rebound after a, uh, their only regulation loss against the Melville Millionaires on the weekend. And if I was to say uh, to Mike Reagan or to anybody, the Bombers would get five goals against Melford tonight, I think everybody would have taken that. I agree. <laughs>